Coming out in a Tampa courtroom today, a jury just handed down a guilty verdict in the first degree murder trial of Richard Miller. He's been convicted now of gunning down his ex girlfriend, who was a home care nurse and a teacher's aide. Fox 13's Gloria Gomez shows us the evidence that the jury weighed before reaching its verdict. It was an ominous text message that would foreshadow a tragic ending. Morning thoughts. Never play with a person. They're dangerous. Prosecutors say that text message was sent by Richard Miller to his ex-girlfriend, Renee Williams. Hours later, they say, she would be dead. He stopped just sending threats. He acted on them. During closing arguments, prosecutors reminded the jury Miller was obsessed with Williams and decided if he couldn't have her, no one would. They say he gunned her down in front of a Brandon apartment complex in November of 2019. During the trial, the state's star witness was Miller's ex-wife, who claimed he confessed to the whole thing. But now, years later, her memory was a little foggy. And what did you say that he told you on the 911 call? On the 911 call that I just previously? Yes. Um, it stated that I said that he said he killed his girlfriend. But the defense says the gun found at the scene can't even be linked to Miller, and the eyewitness testimony can't be trusted. The person that Timothy Warner described could have been any black man. But after deliberating for nearly two hours, the jury determined Richard Miller was that man and found him guilty of killing Renee Williams. Gloria Gomez, Fox 13 News. And after the verdict, Miller was sentenced to life in prison.